welcome to your almost daily love reading. This is Chelsea and I appreciate your love and support for subscribing to my channel. At the end of your reading, I'll pull out more cards for some love and money advice. And Leo, please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. Time is an illusion in tarot, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future. All right, Leo, today we're going to find out how does your person currently feel about you? Spirits angels, please show me how does Leo's person currently feel about them. Leo, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be you or your person you are thinking about or dealing with. Leo, your person thinks about you all night, all day, okay? They are definitely obsessed about you and they think so much to a point that they they feel like hey i gotta stop thinking about leo and the inner ones is here they feel like they want to talk to you okay but i feel like they could be holding back but because the eight of swords is in reverse here so they might eventually take action towards you to talk to you okay but the magician is in reverse here the you know, they feel um they feel like they can't manifest this connection back. They could be feeling weak or don't have the power to do so. But at the same time, with the Six of Swords in reverse, they are definitely still stuck. They can't move on yet from you, okay? Still think about you, still have a lot of emotions towards you, okay? So got the King of Pentacles. Oh, we've got an extra card here. I'll take it. So King of Pentacles here indicates Leo, maybe they feel like you're off of focusing or concentrating on your money, on your career right now. With the Justice here, they feel like you are very serious, perhaps with the decision that you have made in the past or that... Um, Justice could also be somebody whom is very fair, okay? Maybe they feel like you're somebody fair, or I'm, I'm just sensing more so of this very serious energy. Strength card is your uh, energy, Leo. However, this could mean that your person is either holding back or they feel like you're holding back from them, okay? Ten of Wands is in reverse. This is an indication of someone just finally feeling really fed up, okay? Fed up with all the all the stress and all the exhaustion from this connection and they just want to let go. So perhaps they feel that you're letting go from this connection because you're just too exhausted and maybe someone here could be feeling that this is the right thing to do, okay? Again, roles can be reversed in this reading, all right? The fool is in reverse here. Um, Leo Spears says that your person perhaps feels that you don't want to take a chance with them something about this relationship being kind of risky to take a chance or to start over okay king of wands is right here again this is your energy leo there's a lot of your energy here so that's good um that means you're in charge or the ball is in your court some way in some way shape or form here okay or they actually think highly of you um the, with the king of wands here leo i feel like your person thinks that you are somebody very um, still very attractive in their eyes, okay? This could also indicate them wanting to take action towards you because King of Wands is action-oriented. However, the King of Wands is sitting down, so may not be taking action. Plus, right next to it, we've got the strength here. So there's a lot of holding back on their part, I feel, or that they feel you holding back from them, okay? And with the Three of Pentacles here in reverse, Leo, your person feels like you don't want to meet in the middle with them, you don't want to compromise, okay, with them, and that you don't want to fix things with them, okay, or that you don't want to re reconcile. And we've got the Eight of Swords here in reverse, they feel like you're walking out of this connection, okay. It's just, mm, there's something very exhausting about this relationship, okay. And I feel like either they think that they want to let go or they think that you're letting go. You're walking away, okay? There's a sense of feeling trapped as well. And we've got the star here in reverse, trapped mentally and emotionally. Perhaps it is very hard to walk away from this connection, but at the same time, they could be feeling that maybe you are exhausted from this or maybe they're exhausted exhausted from this the stars in reverse they feel like uh, you haven't forgiven them yet okay or that you're still going through healing and recovery let's take one more card 
Six of Cups, so they do miss you. They think about you often. Plus, we got the devil here, okay? So, yeah, they definitely think about you all the time, but at the same time, they are holding back. But they're thinking about they're thinking about taking action towards you, but the Fool is in reverse. Maybe someone here is thinking it's maybe it's not a good idea, right? Maybe it's not a good risk to take. All right, Leo, let's get you some love advice. Love advice for Leo. Seven of Wands is here. If this is if this is something to do with your past person, but you can apply it to if there's somebody new or somebody new in the future. Spirit saying not to um, sort of draw your boundaries. Okay, don't let anybody walk all over you because just remember somebody will take advantage of you and treat you unfairly if you let them walk all over you. But at the same time, it speaks of working as a team. All right. So we've got the Queen of Wands in reverse and the King of Wands. So this is a true match. I feel like this is somebody from your past. Okay. But generally, the advice would be to work together. If you look, both of them are in reverse. You and your person are in reverse here. Either not, not communicating or not seeing eye to eye. Uh, not compromising because you've got the three of pentacles here in reverse. So both may be thinking that, you know, it's the right thing to do or that they are right. Um, but four ones is here. Spirit says that something about needing to work together. You look, there's a guy and there's a girl here. There's four ones indicate stability, okay? It could also indicate marriage. But for me, this time, how I'm seeing it, right next to the Queen of Wands in reverse and King of Wands in reverse, Spirit says, if you want to reconcile with this person for any chance for this reconciliation to be successful, both of you will have to sort of compromise and because both are in reverse. Something about working as a team and com compromising, but at the same time, don't let them walk all over you with the Seven of Wands here. The Justice in reverse. It's kind of tricky. I feel like your relationship with this person can be very complicated, okay? All right, Leo, let's get you some money advice. Money advice for Leo, money advice for Leo. Show me more, Spirit. Two of Wands is in reverse. Spirit says to make a choice, okay? There's something that you need to leave behind with the death card here or transfer transforming okay because eight of pentacles is in reverse spirit says you know you possibly something about working too hard working really hard but not being appreciated or working too hard but you know the outcome is not does not do justice okay but something about making a choice to either transform your career completely or end some sort of a career in your past or business and start over because it looks like all the effort that you put in may either not be appreciated or that the outcome may not be in how do you say it does not do justice in comparison to how much work you put into it, okay? With the Queen of Pentacles in reverse and the Devil in reverse, um, I feel like if it is somebody close to you or anybody or anything, okay? Because the Devil in reverse can indicate uh, letting go of a person who may drag you down. I always think of, you know, love situation, love and love and money, you know, it comes hand in hand. And that's what I want to do. You know, I wanted to add this uh, money advice in your love reading because of this, okay? Somebody with you or were with you in the past, it could be somebody in love or friends or family, whoever, okay? Um, could drag you down financially, okay? May not be a healthy sort of a relationship. Um, the devil in reverse could indicate if you have any bad habits, whether it's spending uh, spending habits or some things that you're indulging in. Um, it could mean overspending as well, you know, like bad habits and things like that, okay? Um, some, things, some things that need to let go of, okay? That may sort of like pull you down financially. 
Um, and also we've got the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Spirit says you need to really transform something here. It looks like hard work itself is not enough. Um, it's almost like people around you or your circumstances or your environment, they all play a very um, big role in your finances and career, okay? So somehow it could have kind of goes in reverse here. I feel like, yeah, definitely something or someone or some sort of an, an environment, bad habits or spending habits could be anything. It could like drag you down. So some things need to be cut off or stop completely. And you something about transforming completely and don't wait and make a choice now. All right, Leo, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. Currently, I am accepting personal reading requests. My information is in the description box below if you'd like to book me. Nothing else. I hope to see you tomorrow as I've been posting videos almost every single day lately. Take care, Leo. Bye.